Okay, this is just a short video um, showing progress so far. We've got this thing in and, it, and it's working um, to, to an extent. It, it doesn't have all its links in place obviously, so when you get a couple of buttons, all it does is just give you a guidance as to where you should be going. If I hit this one, this continue button, it takes me back to my own initialization window. Um, let me just bring the menu back up. Credits, as you might imagine, there's, you know, credit options being selected. If we click on settings you can see the start of the settings menu but I've done nothing with this this is just a mock-up um, uh, and so I sort of get my head around how I best want to deal with all of these numbers because um, it's it's kind of clumsy to to change them one by one I've got an idea of making them a, a single sprite and each of these numbers being a different frame in a sprite uh, but I'm gonna have a fiddle with that and see what I come up with um, yeah, if we go to load game, this is going to release a bug because these are old versions of the software and they don't correspond with the way this thing currently works. So you don't see it, but there's a bug that will pop up behind that. If I click on to new game, it takes us to the scene where we are at the moment. Uh, the words need to be put in for the... Um, but that's not difficult. It's just a case of whether we're going to have the same words operating in every scene to describe the sky and the rocks or, or different ones. Um, okay, that's it thus far. Quit works as well, by the way.